Okay, I think I'm live. And live, I think. Right. Let's get the other stuff out. Hang on, wait a minute, where's that gone? That's weird. There's no chat. There we go. Now there is. And what other docs can I have? That's all looking good. That's how you do that. Okay, that's handy to know. Okay, sorry. Um, well, there's no one here anyway, so I don't even know who I'm apologising to. So that's fine. Uh, let's do that. And I think I can do a toy. that done and switch over and do another do a little bit of a little bit of a retweet there we go cool hey so hi hey Sean how's it going um, yeah, and yeah, hi, Kitty, uh, Kitty and Chod, welcome. Um, yeah, I, I didn't even know it was Glastonbury. Shows how out of touch I am at the moment. I mean, I'm terribly out of touch um, with most things, but uh, yeah. Anyway, let's. Um, I've got I've got some drink, but this is non-alcoholic drink. But I am drinking out of a uh, a Christmas glass. See, it's. Uh, Thing, but it is sadly just uh, Coke Light, as they call it here, which doesn't taste that good. Anyway, uh, let's see where we're up to. Um, I'm on Hitman 2. I don't remember the last one I did. Um... Ah, so it must be... Okay, so hang on. Three-headed serpent. Did I not do that one? No, clearly not. I did that one finish line because that was pretty cool. I enjoyed that. So it must be this one, three-headed serpent. All right, let's give it a go. Good morning, forty-seven. Our Providence contact has shared the identity of the shadow client, mm -hmm. a former mercenary and bodyguard by the name of Lucas Gray. His past is a black void. But our analysts are digging it looks a bit deep. like me. I mean, the character in the game, not uh, comparing the malicious yeah, attack patterns with global shipping and transportation routes. Hey, Jim Jam. We figured out how Mr. Gray Thanks and his joining. paramilitaries move around the world undetected. They're using the distribution network of the Delgado Cartel, Colombia's biggest drug manufacturer. Uh, it's still very hot. Gray must have struck a deal with the Delgado. Which I'm not enjoying. Consequently, if we can cripple the cartel, we can severely limit the malicious strike range. But to do so, we need to slay a three-headed serpent. I'm, I'm all up for slaying. I'm all Delgado up for doing that. And his two closest lieutenants. As long as it's not a man of the cloth. Because I'm not very happy about slaying a man of the cloth. Franco. With equal parts, guts and guile, Rico Delgado hey, runs a thriving billion-dollar criminal empire. The word is, the brutal and volatile cartel head is hell-bent on becoming the number one drug lord in the world. To achieve this, Martinez, a childhood friend of Delgado's, has been buttering up state leaders and decision makers, paving the way for an expansion of the Delgado Logistics Network. 
while the brilliant but aloof and antisocial Franco has been hard at work developing a new type of super cocaine. So, three of Colombia's most infamous crime lords inhabiting a decidedly hostile environment. I will leave you to Thanks for continuing the sub, Sean. I appreciate it. That's great. Ah, oh, man. Right, okay. Let's, um... I mean, I'm drinking nothing exciting with Frey Cosmonaut. I've, I've just saying it's just uh, just Coca-Cola Light, which is inferior. Um, yeah, it's it's inferior to well, it's inferior to UK um, Coke uh, Diet Coke, which is one of my favourite drinks ever. Even though I know it's really bad for you, etc., and all that kind of stuff, but I don't care because it tastes great, and you get used to the taste, then it becomes incredibly addictive. Um, so when I moved to Germany, I was like, well, you know, I've got to, got to drink the same sort of thing over here. Turns out Coke Light here tastes completely different and is horrible. Uh, so mostly I go for the zero. Um, but there wasn't any in the shop the other day, so I ended up with this. And So it's a long story, but uh, generally a very boring story. So I'm going to stop stop talking about that and uh, actually shoot some people. Right, so what have I got to do? I've got two objectives. I've got some targets here. So three people. And... That that's fine, and right, okay. Da, 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 da. Unlimited saves, that's all good. Right, let's get going. Right, so now the question is: Am I going to just try and kill the people I'm supposed to kill, or is this a free for all? I mean, Welcome last time I tried to avoid murdering people because you know it's generally the right thing to do but i'm feeling quite stabby today and so i might have to just um might have to take out quite a few people i think security around santa fortune and the closed off cartel compound tell you what right the other thing that's a bit annoying is um is these lids right this is a new innovation uh, you call it say innovation but it's not really this here, right? You can't take the lids off anymore because they're like they're sealed at the top. Now the reason they're doing this, obviously, is um, oh, thanks for gifting the, the stuff. That's really nice. Um, yeah, so they they've like made it so you can't remove the lid, and obviously this is to try and stop litter and stuff like that. But it's just a bit annoying because it means then every you go and pour it out, the lid kind of gets in the way. Very irritating. I should be watching this, shouldn't I? Rather than talking about the lid on Coke light bottles. Oh, no, it's all gone. Really? Are they doing? Are they doing that in the UK as well now? I thought you didn't have to do this stuff now after Brexit. I mean, that's that's ridiculous. You know, I thought I thought it was just here. I thought it was just a you know European thing, but obviously not. You should be taking back control. You know, you don't have to do this stuff. But they are annoying, you know. Right. Okay. Let's do some murder. Now, I haven't played this for quite a, a long time. So, because of that, I'm going to have to get used to the controls again. Right, that's, that shows me stuff, doesn't it? And then that... Right, that's gun. Okay, I don't want to... Mm. No, no, no. Don't want to... A... Wait. No. What? No, I don't want to... Oh, come on. Right, okay, I'm going to have to restart that. I was just playing around with the uh, the controls, you know? Ugh. Welcome. Right, how do I skip this? Columbia, the Is there a skip? Because I can't Columbia. see it because my Wait screen's in the way. How do I skip this? Okay. It seems I can't. Delgado cartel rules over the village and its surroundings. Oh shit. Sorry. That was probably not good. And the closed off cartel compound is extremely tight. <laughs> Armed carriers patrol the streets of the village, ready to enforce harsh oh, punishments yeah. to those who do not comply. Rumors persist of hidden transportation cave systems connecting the village I just the cartel this compound bit. and the hidden coca fields beyond. It is a rare occurrence to have all three cartel leaders present in the... Ah, oh, okay. Right, so let's save. And then I'll have a look at the controls. 
Right, so aim is that. Move inventory. Place item. Interact. Right, okay, I think I've got it. I think I've got it. How do I do run? I've forgotten. Not like that. How do I run? I can run, right? Oh, that's it. Yeah, I've got it, got it, got it. Okay. Um, Damn, Jay, I'm assuming I can't just walk in there. So there's got to be another way in, isn't there? Is someone going to come come around here? Because then I can... What have I got? What weapons have I got? I fancy some fibre wire at the moment. Oh, so no one's coming over. That's a shame. This is Holcorp. Could I ask you to leave and close the door behind you? Gracias. Okay. Oh, excuse me. Can you leave? Yeah, I can leave. Got money to spare. Oh, there's someone down there, look. So, Pew Power, celebrity tattooist of Tattoo Torment fame, has come to Santa Fortuna. Presumably to work his magic on Rico Delgado, a known ink enthusiast. Sounds like an invitation to the mansion, 47. Are you feeling expressive? So hang on, does that mean I can become a tattoo artist? <gasps> Locate the bar. Okay, let's locate the bar. Do you know, I would be the worst person to be a tattoo artist. Not because I'm scared of like the needles or anything. That, that wouldn't bother me. It's mostly because I can't draw like for anything. And uh, I would I would create some truly horrendous art. It'd be it'd be terrible. Right now, what's going on in here? That is P Power, real name Paul Powers, celebrity tattoo artist and reality TV star. No, no, no. That that should be the forfeit for Matt actually. If if um, what's it called? Uh, Star Wars Outlaws doesn't uh, achieve a better higher a higher Metacritic score than Star Wars Jedi Survivor, then he has to let me do a, do a tattoo of him, a t tattoo on him, not of him. What they, what's the distraction? Oh, that's the other one, right? Okay. To kill me. You have to help me here. Call me ASAP. Just browsing. I am just browsing, yeah. Yeah, yeah, sure, he can he can tattoo me. Um if if uh I mean I'm pretty confident about this one because there's no way that game's gonna be any as anywhere near as good as Jedi Survivor. So how am I going to murder him? All right. Let me know if you need anything cold to drink. Part two. Hmm. He keeps on just going there and then just standing there. It's annoying. Well, maybe what I could do. Have I got a coin? Go on, go for it. No problem. Good job. Come on, come over here. Come over here. What? No, come back in. No, not you. Sod off. Whoa, You're not having it. Buddy, that's married. for someone else. Oh, that's really annoying. Stupid backpacker. Hang on, maybe I can do it from uh, from here. 
Go on, go and have a look. Oh, bloody hell. Go on, just go and have a look at the coin. There's a lovely old coin over here. That's it, come on have a look, come on. That's it, lovely stuff. Thumbs up. Go, you did. Wait. Don't mislead, help me. This is where you step up to the plate, man. Uh, no one's getting the shit kicked out of them, they're fine. Uh, what do I do? Hey, you there, come in. Who did this? What did you? What? Take on your tongue? I think I got away with it. I mean, the only problem is, is that when he wakes up, he's going to be able to identify me. But never mind. Now, what, okay, so I've... What have I got to do now? Let's have a look. Where's this mansion? Okay. Oh, it's over here somewhere. Should have, I mean, I should have snapped his neck, really, shouldn't I? I mean, that was the wrong thing to do, but never mind. Hey, what's up, man? Sit down, relax. The universe will correct itself again, right? How do I get over there? I suppose. I mean, I managed it, shy, by just messing around and kind of messing. I think I should save, shouldn't I? Because, um, let's save there. There we go. See that fat power guy? Hang on, man. I hope you don't mind, but we need to freeze him. Oh, shit. I've got guns. Um, okay, so they're going to frisk me. I'm going to have to drop my weapons, aren't I? How do I drop it? Uh, like that. Right, the rest is all good. Hey, let me in. Let me in. Hey, Motto Soup, how's it going? I've messed up. Right, okay, let's reload that because that went a bit wrong. So I need to dump the guns first, don't I, before I, uh, before I go in there. Otherwise they're going to be all suspicious. Maybe I'll dump them here before I get to the, uh, the other place. It's a shame because I quite like these, these weapons. Particularly the, uh, the fibre wire. Let's give this a go. I've not murdered anyone yet, actually. I've only uh, punched someone. I'm now a tattooist. No, you can't, Shod. It says um, it says illegal item last time I when I tried it. They don't like it. Go and frisk me. Ah, well, you know, just security precaution. All right, Mr. Power. Hey, ben. Oh, Bongale, Follow Bongale. me to the house. Mrs. Delgado wanted to meet you. She's a big fan of you. She'll take you to Rico afterward. The only trouble is I haven't got so any weapons now. Artist, huh? I put some ink on skin as well in my time. Of course, most of that was in prison, and not always on people who appreciated the work. You know how hard it is to tattoo traitor on a guy's forehead while he's squirming around on the ground like a worm? It's not very nice. Not easy, let me tell you. That's quite a story. I know. Oh my god! Oh. It's really you, Pipawa. It's such 
such an honor to meet you. I just love your show. That episode where you tattoo the heart of the Harlot of that dying policeman while they're administrating CPR. <laughs> It's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen! A great moment. Is she one of the people I'm supposed to eliminate? To She's day. not, is she? Oh, I see. So, Rico has this tattoo on his neck, and he insists it's supposed to be based on your photo of me. I'm not a fool, Mr. Powers. My nose never looked like that, not mm -hmm. even before the operation. And sure, I've had a few ticks done here and there, but nothing as drastic as that. I want you to make it look like me, not some young skank. I'll do my very best, Mrs. Delgado. <laughs> oh, Chico. Let me just grab a quick selfie with you, all right? Go on, then. Sure, why not? Yay! <laughs> just look this way. <laughs> Okay, excellent. He, he, you're right, he sh absolutely should have different accents. He just sounds the same all the time. So far, so good. 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 Now to leave your mark on Mr. Delgado. Oh, this is the famous P. Power, that do artist to the stars. Yeah. You don't exactly look like you do on TV. How much for a cover-up tattoo? Cariño, don't insult our guest. He's obviously not been sitting in a stylist chair for days, but this is P power. Who else would it be? Well, what about those cheekbones? Well, this is going to be interesting. The guy on TV didn't have cheekbones like that. Hey, Rico, enough. You know they fix all beds in post-production. Just let Okay, let's save, because... Yeah. Man work. Okay, fine. What have I got to hit? So I've only got, I've got nothing. Apart from my bare hands. But that's all I need. Where's he going? I mean, could I take this guy out? No, I've never tried it in VR. I probably should. Um, right, let's try the old coin again. Come in here. Right, okay, let's save. Because I've got a diabolical plan here. Nicely done. Right. Got rid of him. Now, where's this other person gone, though? And what's supposed to start tattooing as start tattoo as the tattoo artist? So I can't do it because he's not here. He's he's disappeared. So at least I've got weapons now. That's good. I mean, I don't like the chances of getting out of this alive. I mean, look how many there are. But where's this dude gone? Oh, there's always a poison thing, isn't there? Yeah, yeah, well. Not in there. 
I was going to do a tattoo on him. Why don't they want me to do a tattoo? I mean, why should I sit in the tattoo? I'm the one doing the tattooing. Why should I sit in the tattoo? I mean, why should I sit in the chair? I'm the one doing the tattooing. I'm going to be dead honest with you. I've got my ex-girlfriend Margarita's name tattooed on my groin. And I want to get a chance at something else. Look, if I go over here, nothing happens. If I press the button, nothing happens. Start tattoo as the tattoo artist. Where has he gone and is he going to come back? off again. No, there is there's, there's a chair there. There's like a tattoo chair there with all the ink and everything. It's just that for some reason he just left the room and wandered off over here. And I don't really know why. Oh, it looks like there's been a murder or something over there. So he just keeps wandering over there. That's not happening, is it? So maybe I'm better off just being security. And then, um... There you go, got some intel. Yeah, see, look, he's over there. But I could blend in as the, as the security for the place. And then just um, maybe murder him over there. Because I've got this guy, I could go for this guy's security uniform. Like that. Because it seems I'm not going to get to do the tattooing stuff. Which... Alright, okay, I have to be careful there, because uh, some of these people know me, it seems. Scissors, always useful. Oh, no, I don't want to go in there. That's uh Bird from way back in Bogota. Hector, what kind of Rico or Solito hang around? Baby Bubble, you know? Andre and Rico were always super tight, but only as friends. I can't really imagine Hector and Martinez being an item. Well, from what I understand, it was explosive. Gosh, it's quite a lot of money, isn't it? He blew up her car one night after they had a fight. Ended that relationship real quick. I heard they raided Mexican pueblos together back in the day. Born in Clyde, kind of thing. There are lots of rumors about them, but most are fake. Where's he gone? So has he gone down here now? All right, all right, all right. Let's save. Sorry, I know this is maybe not terribly exciting, but I'm just trying to figure this out. Let's save that. He's just completely disappeared now. Did you hear Javier stole the love letter Hexo Delgado wrote to my sister? After John Barra went 
No, I mean, oh, oh, look. This one, right? See, it just says I've completed it. I don't want to find the broken souvenir. Broken? Broken. Very strange, you know. Are you... Ah! Hey, you can't go around and smash heads in like that. Yeah, I can. Okay. They'll talk. Right, let's um. <sighs> I'm a bit stuck now. I don't know. What, hang on, wait a minute. He's back on the floor. Right, okay. Let's... Because that, that was needless, obviously. I didn't need to do that. So let's, um, let's go back to here, I think. And see if he comes back. Then I can do him in. Because I think he's down there somewhere. Right now, if I can get him just in here, keep up the good work. Oh, this guy is annoying. Time to get this updated. Delgado has been eliminated. Yes, he has. Now, there's got to be somewhere here I can hide this body. I think over here. There we go. Three. Right, let's save. That went reasonably smoothly, actually. Not bad. Now, I'm wondering whether maybe I could do with a better disguise. Oh, no, not that one. Right, okay, that didn't work. Oh, that's annoying, isn't it? You just think, what? She, how did she see that? Or maybe I just don't bother with this disguise and just go out. Right. Oh, it's because she was there. Okay, that's why. Actually, I don't think I need to change. I'm good with what I've got. Right, so, we we'll just get out of here right now. Not, not that one, right. Let's have a look at the, where's the map? Because this one, right, I can just get out of this building now, right? So. Yeah, I just need to get out of here without getting uh, shot up. Actually, you know what I need to do? I'm a genius. I've got an idea. If I become T power again, no one's going to care. These dudes haven't got a problem with me. So 
still just needs to walk out. And this shouldn't be that suspicious of me just running away. Can, can you let me out, please? So, there we go. Nice. Right, okay, let's pick up my fibre wire and my gun. Put them away. And let's find the next target. I think he's over there somewhere. Right, let's have a look at the map. Uh, if I'm there, how do I get there? Well, it seems I could do it from... Mm. Maybe I should have done it from in there. Right, okay, let's... Can I go back in? Although I have picked up my guns. But they know I'm, they know I'm cool now, right? Oh, that means I've got to lose my guns. Right, okay, I need to... Sorry, I need to reload because I'm not losing my my weapons just in case, you know. But I think that, that is the way to go. I need to become the tea power guy again. And then I can... Uh, I can find my way around to the other place. Let's see if I can figure this out. Right, so I need to just get out of the mansion. And then go out there somewhere, yeah? So do I go this way? It looks like I go this way. Now, I don't know if I'm supposed to go this way or not, so let's save. You're entering the lion's den, Fisher 7. Ah. Tread carefully. Practically everyone here is dangerous, not least Rico Delgado himself. Okay, it seems they don't like me being in this area. gone badly. Let's let's try this again because this is obviously not works. Right, so it seems I can't just wander through here. But can I wander through here if I'm a mansion guard? Yeah it's all it's all gone wrong. Practically everyone here is dangerous, not least Rico Delgado himself. You don't allow me being in there. Right, okay. Den 47. Tread carefully. Practically everyone here is dangerous, not least Rico Delgado himself. Yeah, no shit. Ah, oh, see, I need something silent. What's this over here? Ooh, maybe I can go this way. Hang on, wait a minute. Can I get back in that way? I can. Right, that means I can go and pick up my weapons and then come back.
I mean, the thing is, right, is I get criticised for this, but I get the job done. And that's all that matters, ultimately. Targets get eliminated. That's what the guy... I mean, I'm being a hitman, am I? That's what it's about. Okay, let's try something. Let's try turning off this air conditioner and then seeing if they come out and then I can source it. Yeah, I am totally safe coming away. Look, I can play this however I feel, you know? And this is the way I enjoy playing this game. Right, let's get this way. Now, does this... Oh, it seems they're cool with me being here, so that's good. The only trouble is, is they're going to find that body, aren't they? And it's all going to be on alert. But it's fine, I can get out of here. Oh dear. They found a body. Oh, hang on, hang on. Maybe I can become one of these people. Alright, let's save. The trouble is there's two of them. It's always quite challenging to take on two. Maybe I can get... too close. I've got a vague idea of the story, Luke Cage. Vague idea. I wouldn't say, you know, I know exactly what's going on, but uh, I have some idea. How do I reload? I've forgotten. There we go. Maybe I should hide those bodies. Right, so the dude is over here somewhere. Oh, 
Oh, here he comes. That is Jorge Franco, the Delgado Cartel's chief chemist. Somebody help! Please! Get behind me and keep low! Vamos! Yeah, yeah! Stay low, follow me, and do exactly what I say, and you'll be. Ah, no! Franco okay. confirmed down. Nice work. Possibly, um, Luke H. In terms of Alan Wake, because I enjoyed that game quite a lot when I played it the first time round. Do you know what, Luke H. You're right. I am a mint person. I like mint. Now I know I'm compromised, so I need to get some new clothing, don't I? These people here look suitable. Oh, wait a minute, they don't care, do they, these people? Another traveller finds his way here in search of a spiritual release. Come on in, my friend. You're free to join us. Everyone is a victim here with the eyes of experience. I mean, I need their clothes. really out of it. The brew has transported you out of it to a place of tranquility and I need their clothes, and I, but I know I shouldn't kill them. You will see. I mean, I could just knock them all out, couldn't I? Yeah, but I mean, they're like completely stoned. They I mean, two of them are. Others. Their senses no longer register their physical surroundings. I mean, look, I'm just going to knock them out, okay? Because I need their clothes, because that will make things a bit easier. Because I'm a bit suspicious like this. I ain't gonna murder them. I mean, they were just sitting around doing nothing anyway, so. There you go. Now I'm a shaman. Or shaman. Alright, oh, he's in the fire. That's not good. Look. I'll help him out. I'll pull him off the fire. Yeah, I know they're just having fun, but look, they're, they're fine, because look, they'll wake up. And this will be like a fun experience they can tell people. So I'm not poisoning them. I've not killed anybody. See? It, yeah, I mean, look, it's fine. It's completely fine. All right, let's get out of here. Oh, look, there's a story here. Let's have a listen. Good to see you, Senor. May the spirits guide you to fortune. Thank you. I hope you won't take offense, but we were asked by Andrea Martinez to come here, talk to you about the cleansing ritual at the construction site. I see. Can you remind me about the details? Of course, Taita. The construction crew uncovered some. Okay, I don't know what's going on there, but never mind. Let's just keep going. I think it's going pretty well. Now I just need to get into this place and do the final murder. 
Kaita, good to see you here. Tell the people know me, they love me. Let's do a save. Ah, Taita. It's a pleasure to see you in the village. Will they let me in? Oh wow! I mean, look, come on, I've struck it gold. I've struck gold with this. Although, I don't think I'm supposed to be in there. Let's have a look. I mean, there's. Oh, wait a minute. There's a person over there. Martinez, the Delgado Cartel PR officer and public face. We're all working on it. So the statue is still unstable. Yes, Martinez. But as long as no one tampers with it, it should hold. And the van? Still missing. Guess what else will be missing if you don't get this in order? I'm returning to my office. Get this fixed now. I, I will take care of it. Okay. Well, so it's well, the famous oh, shaman decides to show up after all. Oh, I'm pleased boy. to finally put a face to the myth. Oh. I was beginning to think you didn't exist, what with oh. your not replying to any of my inquiries. I've been looking forward to oh. meeting you, Miss Martinez. All right. How are you? I need you to get over to the construction site on the outskirts of the village. The workers there uncovered a pile of old oh, bones and they've taken the opportunity to grab some undeserved recreational time. Oh, I need you to go over there as soon as possible and wave your magic wand or do an interpretive dance or whatever it is you do. Oh, I can do that. You can walk with me if you don't know the way. Otherwise, I'll see you there. Just sure. don't take too long. I'm more than happy to walk with you. Very well. Go on, get going. I haven't been to the construction site in some time, actually. It'll be good to get to see the new equipment. It was certainly expensive. Do you know how hard it is to transport a cutting-edge brand new cement mixer and pora around in the jungle? Very. I can only imagine, Miss Martinez. Right, I need a good opportunity here. Is these two guards? So, 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 yeah, it was it was Matt that played Ace Attorney whilst listening to podcasts, which I just don't understand. Hey, Lulu. Oh, I'm definitely up for that. I'll do my very best. God, those guys creep me out. Right. What is there here that I can do to cause an accident? There must be something I can do here to like make her, make her come to an un unpleasant end. Rip off as much stuff as I can. Hmm. Where's she gone? Oh, she's over there. There are too many guards. That's the problem.
what happens if I turn off the generator? Alright, let's save. Let's see what happens. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's, I mean, they're all pretty much like this, um, Sean. Like, they're... They're pretty big levels, usually. I'm fine. I'm... Just to commune with your spirit guides and let them know you. All right, here we go. Look. Thank you for your spiritual leadership and guidance to the site is clean now. Well. Hey Rambo, check that out. Okay. Hey you. Excellent. A beautiful ritual. Okay, that didn't that didn't work. Um. She didn't, and that's the shame, isn't it? Might as well do the ritual. Thank you for your spiritual leadership and guidance. The site is clean now. She needs to move a bit more in that direction. I've got an idea. Right, let's save, let's save, because I've got an idea. Hopefully she's going to move. Yeah. Go on, can I have a look? Targets neutralized. This should paralyze the cartel. Excellent work, Pearson. Now head for an exit. I've not seen shit here. See, not running. I'm a smooth operator. See, I, I mean, do you know, it was fortunate, wasn't it, that I ended up, um, you know, in that glade where there was this guy, and then I had the idea of just knocking them all out, because then I ended up with one of the best suits in the game. Well, in this level, anyway. There we go, and I'm off. Mission success. Three. Rare achievement then. Yeah, see, that worked out pretty well. What did I get? I got... See, I'm a flexible murderer. That's pretty good. I mean, it's rare at Luke Cage because I don't think that many people have played this. <laughs> it seems... That's what seems to happen to me most of the time with this. Or at least there are not many people have played it. Um, on here. 
Ooh. Right. Excellent. Back in Surrey. Mission status. Columbia assignment successful. Tactical targets neutralized. Militia transport network disabled. Location of primary target unknown. Team chasing several leads. End message. Encrypt and send. I like my Series S. It's great. That's what I'm playing on here at the moment. I'm not as strong as you. They have to pay for what they did. It needs to stop. You need to stop. If my source checks out, we can prove the board knew about the chemical leaks. We'll have grounds for a retrial. It won't make a difference. They're too powerful. Not the devil, Nancy. Just a company. They're not above the law, don't you see? This is bigger than James. Those bastards killed 80 people. And they got away with it. Think about what that means. No one's untouchable. No one's untouchable. Diana! Sorry, I'm just sending messages. Um, Right, what's going on now? What have I missed? We got what we can. Move out. Someone's gone, gone bang. Right. Okay. Ugh. Okay. Next up. So what's that? Is this chasing a ghost? Is next, or is that the one I just did? That's not the one I just did, right? I get right. This. Uh, I get a bit confused sometimes with this, and with many things at the moment. So we've done that one. Yeah, the three-headed serpent looked at that. Right, so it is chasing a ghost is next. Okay, I mean, I might as well kick it off. I don't know if I'm going to get that far, but... Um... Oh, man, there's quite a lot here. Good evening, 47. The militia has released a hostage tape, outing the existence of Providence to the world. This was a fatal mistake, and our analysts are tracing its origin as we speak. In the meantime, we have a lead on Lucas Gray's top lieutenant. Turns out the Delgado cartel's counterfeiting unit was creating fake IDs for the militia, and one operative in particular stands out, Wazir Kale, an infamous South China Sea pirate better known by his nom de guerre, the Maelstrom. The Maelstrom and his cutthroat band of outlaws were the scourge of the shipping industry in the post-recession years. But his reign of terror came to an end with the disastrous 2014 hijacking of the supertanker, Francis King. Chinese elite forces stormed the ship, resulting in the deaths of a dozen sailors and most of the Maelstrom's crew. But Carle slipped away unseen. The Maelstrom's connection to Grey is unknown. 
but we believe it was he who carried out the audacious killing of a Providence CEO in Shanghai, along with two reactivated members of his old pirate gang, Vanya Shaw, a shady figure in Mumbai's criminal underworld, and this is well complicated, isn't it? the gang's old cashier turned dodgy. I'd love to know what this story's all about. Shaw, Rangan, and the Maelstrom form Lucas Gray's Eastern Cell. Maybe I'll watch one of those um, YouTube videos that like explains everything. Pressing concern. After I finish the game. The elusive Maelstrom appears to have vanished into the seedy underbelly of Mumbai, the cradle of his criminal legend, and no one knows his whereabouts or what he currently looks like. So, a bandit queen, a showbiz charlatan, and one certifiable ghost. So what have I got? Lead you to they prepare. keep this is what you see. I swear it feels like they just keep adding like more and more targets each time. Hmm. I kind of liked it when it was just like one, you know, so it's just like, okay, I'm, I'm going to go for this person. Oh dear. Feeling a bit tired, isn't it? Welcome to Mumbai, Forty Seven. One of the most densely populated cities in the world. Home to more than 12 million people. If you want to people. disappear and hide from the world, this vast city is perfect. The maze like, sprawling slums offer secret paths and surprises around every corner. The elusive Maelstrom knows the city. Is that right, Trot? Didn't know that. Locating him will be a considerable challenge. This is on professional difficulty, I think, isn't it? Or the, the whatever the standard difficulty is. Darwood Rangan will be easy to find in this half-finished tower, wrapping up his new film called Mumbai Hero. Arvani Shah has ensconced herself in the overgrown remains of an old train yard. Your three targets call this labyrinthine part of the city home, so choose your approach carefully. So it's like a two for one, I guess, shot with that. What kind of weapons have I got? Okay, I've got some weapons, that's good. Gang known as the Crows are on high alert. They seem to be on the lookout for potential assassins and will be suspicious of anyone they don't recognize. I suggest you are mindful around them in the slums. Good plan. Good plan. Unless I become one of them. Our intel suggests the Maelstrom is hiding somewhere in the city slums. I've marked the headquarters of the Crows on your map. I mean, I don't, I do, I don't look great, do I? You don't have the right clearance, sorry. Huh. did you have any luck? No, that tailor is impossible. I explained to his employee that Miss Shah wants to meet with him, but he claimed that the tailor wasn't available. So you didn't just go inside and look? Only the Royal Guard can do stuff like that. I'm sure Miss Shah will send someone with more hands-on experience than me. He's the only tailor in town that can make that damn dress. That's what happens when you drown all the others, I guess. It appears Vanya Shah is in the market for a dress fit for a queen. She's sent after a local tailor, but for some reason the man refuses to cooperate. A man of your impeccable mm. taste should be able to fill in perfectly for the tailor. Okay, so I can get in there and dress up.
Hmm. It's true, isn't it, Dave Hodgkins? He really does. Yeah, I'm not doing that because, I mean, Luke Cage, the thing is with that is a no save run just basically means that I'll end up just murdering everybody. Where's the tailor gone then? Oh, he's out there. Okay. So I'm trying to get rid of all the witnesses. It probably is, you know, quite possible to do that. Is he over there? This is what I keep having. It's they just keep on like just fucking off to other places. Forgetting the um, detective vision stuff. Oh no, it's not. I was going to, oh, okay, that hasn't worked. Oh, okay. Disaster. Didn't work. I mean, maybe I just have to do all the people in this shop so I can dress up. I mean, that works. Excellent. Let's find out what kind of dress a woman like Vanya Shah wants. Right. I mean, that totally worked. Gonna have to hope that nobody, um, look, they're not dead. I've just punched them, that's all. No murder this time. This is better, if anything, than before.
Yeah, I've not murdered anyone. I don't know what everyone's getting so worked up about. I've just punched them in the face, and they're just they're just gone to sleep for a bit, like this dude. He'll be fine. Look at him. Look, he's just having a nap. He will be absolutely fine. So, he's just hiding in there now? Yeah. Oh, shit. There's people up there. I was hoping there would be a, because uh, I can't, I don't think I can dump him in here, can I? Because it's full. He told us to say he was out of town, but I'm not sure the guy bought it for you. Oh, I just had to dump him here. Shah wants a cerulean dress, 47. Okay. Perhaps you will be able to source a roll of the right fabric at the local cloth market. I'll have the coins because they're always useful. Let's save. I, I, I sleep like a baby, Luke Cage, you know. I think that was highly successful. Got my new disguise, so hopefully those other people won't be after me. Yeah, that is, uh, that is true. Greetings, sir. Can I interest you in my fine wares? Cheap, durable cloth in any special... You there! Oh, shit. I, ah! I didn't mean to steal. I just wanted to haggle. Oh man, every time I play this I forget how thoroughly good it is. I know I'm playing it in a unique way, well not unique way, but you know, in a bit of an aggressive way, but it is great. See? Okay. Which one should I go for? Hang on, wait a minute. What's the... Cerulean Croft. Okay. Great. Thank you. Come again. There we go. Get out of the way. Right, let's uh, let's save. Ah, it's you. Did you bring the cloth from Miss Shah? Yes, I have it right here. About bloody time! Come with me. Oh, don't be alarmed, by the way. Miss Shah takes security very seriously, so the oh. guards will search you. Not to worry. Of course they will. Oh, that means I need to dispose of these. Weapons, don't I again? I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I oh, know the fiber wire is okay, you're right. Chud, I stand corrected. You were correct. What up? Come on, let's see what you have in your pockets today. I'm not exactly enjoying this either, so just stay still and we'll be done soon. You were I I I apologize. Oh, heartily for that. I thought it was another oh, illegal yeah. item. But it wasn't. I'm really, like, beginning to realise that I'm just, like... It's not wise to keep her waiting. I don't remember anything right. It's terrible at the that moment. It's worse than usual. She's not been happy with the other tailors. A word of warning. Just play along with her eccentricities. She can be rather dangerous. Thank you. I'll do my best. Good man. Do well and there will be a lot of money in it for you. I know. Oh, hi. Here we are. The queen Just go through there. 
lot of that is making The queen is waiting for you in the garden. I'm sure she'll help you if you just show That me. is Vanya Shah, self-appointed queen of the Mumbai slums. How are you, sir? Right, better... Better save. Elusive dealer. Here at last. Let's have an excellent. See? Five that was the right one. Progress here. Come with me. I want you to take my measurements while you're here. Smart work, 47. Shah will want to have privacy when measuring for the dress. I'll leave the final execution up to you. Okay. The measuring right away. If you didn't forget tape, then what is the measuring right there with tape that's left us behind? You can use that. Yeah. Certainly can. I'm ready. Begin your measurements now. I'm bothered about this woman here. Hmm. It's a classic. Confirmed kill on Vanya Shaw. Excellent work, 47. No rest for the wicked, however. On to the next one. There we go. All done. Nothing wrong with saving. I don't know what's the problem with that. Particularly because the thing is, I'm playing this on stream, and if I have to play large sections again, that'll get even more boring. So, you know. Yep, she didn't. Right. Let's get out of here. Right, let's have a look at the map. Right, so the next, there's this target here, or there's these. But I think I'm going to leave the maelstrom thing for the moment. So have I got to get in there? Is that yeah right? I do. You wanna go? Is that it? Happy to, but there's people around who can see what's going on. Probably shouldn't garrot him. Or 
services and why are you in over here? You're not fit to enter, sir. Okay, so that's not happening. There's got to be another way in. Right, okay. Oh, I've got no coins because I spent them all. Now, the only thing here is, is I need somewhere to dump these bodies, so they don't get seen. There's got to be somewhere, right, let me just save again, obviously. I guess. What's that? Oh. I'm w I'm a big fan of a screwdriver. Right in the neck. You know, it's the uh it works very well. In the game. Oh, these people are dressed differently. Are they crew? Maybe I can go for them. Okay, I think first of all... Um... Brick's always useful. And a screwdriver. Got lots of them. Okay. Let's save, and then I'm going to see if I can, how far I get as a security guard. Because I need to get up there. You know, he faced that one on a true story. His experiences as a South China Sea pilot. A jerk. Oh, I can go this way. Okay, let's go this way. Is the plan good to go? I know they're still trying to find the right line for the chute, but in case they do, we need to be ready with the deck. You bet. I had to hack the controls to reduce the power output of the machine. I you know what sticks? Oh, this Okay. Arthur, a 
famous Broadway star is apparently late for a photo shoot inside Rangan's unfinished tenement tower. Hang on, he uploaded a selfie on. Okay, good to know. Now with you around, I feel safe. Right, okay, so if I dress up as that guy then, then this will make this easier. I mean, the thing is, Luke Cage, is I can't speak for them. I really can't. So, yeah, I, I can't. I can't make any promises, honestly. I mean, I'll do it. No problem. But I don't know about the others. I can't make promises. There he is. Gregory Arthur's cell phone signal. He's close by. But how am I going to get his costume? Oh, what the hell is that? That smells like my first dressing room off Broadway. That's lit. I, I, I didn't too think many I would ever around. smell anything that bad again. <laughs> I mean, look, is there anyone around? Don't hit me! They got someone your own side, Oh, okay. I can't do it there, that's obvious. I mean, I need to get place quick, Gregory. No way. What the hell? Hey, hello. There's been an accident over here. There we go. Interesting look, forty seven. Well, Darwood Rangan is at the tower expecting Mr. Arthur any minute now. No need to keep him waiting. That worked. Where do we go this way? Yeah? Man, I've gone the wrong way, I think. Or have I? Can I go this way? I mean, I presume they're going to let me in, seeing as I'm a. Uh if you want to pass, you need to be frisked first. Is that a problem? Fuck's sake. Weapons again, isn't it? I have to drop my guns. Or just going this way. And then it shouldn't be a problem, yeah? Right, let's get up there. Damn it, that guy's going to be suspicious. Oh, how do I get out of here? 
Oh shit. I'm stuck. No, I'm not. There we go. I mean, this also works, it seems. That didn't work. Oh. It's all gone wrong, isn't it? annoying, wasn't it? I'm as close to playing Zero Escape now as I was before. They were fine with that last time. Or did I press the wrong button? It's possible I pressed the wrong button. Look, 47. Well, Darwood Rangan is at the tower expecting Mr. Arthur any minute now. No need to keep him waiting. Right, okay. Let's just drop the guns. And I'll go in the, the normal way. It's not out on Switch, is it, that series? If it was on Switch, there's more likely that I'd play it, but, you know. Hey, you! You have no business here! Get lost, Bozo! I'm getting frisked. Hold that position. We'll be done in no time. Right then, off you go. Right, so that dude's over there. I mean, I can't get in. Because the trouble is, is I need to get over there. You're walking the set after all. <laughs> I thought you said you'd never be on one of Rangan's productions again. It's true, but what can you do? I can't there we go. That, that's more like it. I did like Paranormal Sight, that was great. <sighs> I'm here. Excellent. This means we can get on with it. Good. Good. There we go, it's all gonna happen. So what do I do now? Just wait for him to do, do to turn up. So, I just wanted to say, I absolutely loved you in Blundering Frights. I thought it
it was a brilliant performance in a very funny horror comedy. Oh, thank you. You know, my brother directed it. I'll be sure to let him know you liked it. There he is. It didn't do very well, but, but I understand it has become something of a cult classic in Europe. How's everyone? Ready for the photo shoot? I know I am, so let's do this. Great. Folks, let's all get into position for the big photo, shall we? All right. Let's get this done. Show me those teeth now. This is a big moment. Final wrap. Everyone's happy, right? So, Miss Hassan, I guess you're ready for another round of Mumbai Heroes soon. I've got big plans for us. Hmm? Mm -hmm. Big plans. I'm sure you will. I think you will need to talk to my agent about that. Ah, agents, I never did like them. Deco, I prefer the more direct approach. Acha. Well, I'm hopefully kicking off some international roles soon. So, my availability may be limited. I see. Well, I certainly hope nothing should happen that would prevent you oh, from pursuing your goals, Miss Hassan. Great work. Now. If we could do a few shots of just Mr. Arthur and Miss Hassan, please. Arthur and Hassan? As if they're that important. I suggest we do another round of solo shots of the guy who gets first billing. Me. <laughs> if you say so, Mr. Rangan. Uh, I do, I do say so. Come, come. Shoot. Oh, Gregory, stick around, huh? I want to talk to you when I'm done here. All right, people. Get off the stage! It's time for the big guy to do his magic. Excellent, 47. It looks like Rangan wants a private word. Great. I, I can do private words. Right. That's perfect. Oh, maybe this way is good. Huh? The women really like this pose. <laughs> Are, when I pull off this look, all housewives in a two-mile radius will faint automatically. Well done, Mr. Rangan. That's excellent. Come on, get on with it. I want to... All right. You know. I think that's enough beauty shots for one day. Great. That's a wrap then. Champagne for everyone. You never know would? Great things will come from this movie, guys. Let me tell you, I've got a feeling that this one is the one that will make me famous. You know, it just goes to show that hard work and dedication is what is needed in this business, yeah. Oh, stop talking. You know, Mr. Rangan, you wanted to see me. Ah, Gregory. Yes, yes. Come with me upstairs. I have something important to talk to you about. It'd be my pleasure. Gregory, Gregory, as you know, there's a lot at stake with a production like this. Hmm? Everyone needs to play ball. We are on the same team after all. But it's important to establish a pecking order. Hmm? Soon all of Mumbai will be mine. I'm sure you can imagine what that means. Oh, do behind as well. It's a bit annoying. What have I got? Okay. Okay, Gregory. I just need my friend here to back you down. Again? Don't I want any recording devices or things like that accidentally going off. Hmm? I'm sure you understand. Yeah, sure. Have a good day. If you want to come through this way, I'm going to have to do a quick pat down. Go for it. Sir, I'm just doing my job. Just don't take Thank my God screwdrivers. Sorry about that. They're just for minor repairs. And you are good to go, sir. Thank you. Oh, there's far too many guys coming with us. Here's the deal. And don't interrupt me, alright? I hate being interrupted. 
You're a smart guy, I know that. Big deal back in America. But the thing is, I don't like you. I don't like the way you dress, the way you behave yourself around the women on set, or the way you try to steal from Fight Panda. I'm willing to overlook all of this, Gregory, because we can make great things together. However, and this is very important, if you ever try to take my place, if you ever think you can become bigger than Daud Rangar, I am, because I'm just hoping that I can do this in a clean way. Anyone and everyone will die. Do as I tell you, and I can make you more famous than you've ever dreamed of. Cross me, and you're dead. Understood? I think I understand. Excellent. In that case, we're done here. We're really not. Rangan is confirmed killed. Smashed through that window, then but didn't work. Oh dear, I'm compromised. Ah. ah, didn't work. Right, okay, okay, okay. That didn't work, obviously. We need to take a different approach. killed just one target left let's bring this one home i mean he deserved it but that was better i threw a brick in that guy's face and then uh then it all worked out can i just chuck his body off i can it seems I mean, actually, I shouldn't do that, should I? I should probably just leave it. Right, okay. Okay, let's get out of here. Not so fast, Mr. Arthur. I got orders to keep you here until Mr. Rankin leaves. Okay. I'll just go this way. Just wondering whether maybe I should um, have a bit. I don't want 
what the event is wrong. Alright, let's get out of here. We're out. There we go. Right now, let's go off to somewhere else. So I could do with that guy's uniform, couldn't I, really? Because then I could infiltrate the crow's hideout. But the trouble is, is if I do him in. Right, let's save. Man, I should stop this soon. This has been a this has been a long old stream actually. Much longer than uh, than I intended. I keep finding bodies now, that's not good. Right, let's see if I can figure out how to get to this place. A dude. Get out of the way. Oh, it's just too many people. I'm just wondering whether if I just take this guy's clothing that will help me out. I thought I had a crowbar. Maybe that'll work. Just 
Are you down? I mean, these are bad people, so, you know. Let's bring them in. with the other ones, or maybe I should. Because otherwise people are going to be like, oh, what's going on out there? Why is there a load of dead bodies? Hey, Tiny Noodle. Welcome. save again. Delving straight into the heart of darkness, Forty Seven. Seven. Good luck. Some they thank God this is one of the furnaces in the metal workshop. But Abbot, this is the third time you're asking me this question. What's wrong with you? Nothing's wrong with me, okay? I just want to make sure I don't mess up when the boss asks me to do something. Just relax. Yes, you grab the powder. Into the furnace, lots of smoke goes up. Whatever happens after that isn't your concern. Okay, good. I wonder what does happen after this smoke goes up. Oh, I don't have a lock. A lock pick or something, you know? Wrench? Will that help? I don't think I can wrench the door. Where's my screwdriver? There it is. Hey, wait. A photograph and a note addressed to Sagar the Barber. This looks like a very recent picture of the Maelstrom. Okay. With this in hand, picking him out in a crowd should be possible. As I said, yeah, uh, welcome <laughs> to to the stream. Um, yeah, no, I'm good. I don't need an ASCII guide. I can probably figure this out. Um, ah, there he is. Right, okay, let's save it. This is going well. This is going very well. 47, that man there. He resembles the Maelstrom. Try they all to do. Get close to him for a visual ID. That wasn't him. No. Is this what this is like? That nose, those eyes. That can only be Wazir Kai, the Maelstrom. Identification confirmed. Right, have I got a brick? No, I've not got a brick. I don't know exactly what I'm going to do though. Every pot needs to be stirred occasionally. Hold on a minute, to all. The infamous Maelstrom is dead. Very well done, 47. Mission completed. Time to find an exit. There we go. And now I'm just a harmless food vendor. Oh, 
Don't want to. Right, I think that did the trick. It's for food vendor walking around with a machine gun on his back. Wowzers. And that's two two missions in one evening. I'm impressed with myself. Adaptable enforcer, because of course I am. Man, this is about unlocking all sorts of stuff. Ooh. Oh, I got to stop in a second. It's like midnight here. When the estate was overtaken by an obscure Soviet research fund, the Institute for Human Betterment. It looks deserted. The place was abandoned after a fire in 89. Then, only a few weeks ago, it was acquired by an anonymous investor using cryptocurrency. It has to be Lucas Gray. I mean, how to date something. Talk He's back here. Auto. Be careful, 47. The breadcrumbs are almost too easy to follow. It could be a trap. A trap. It's uh, just a lot of NFTs. An invitation. You came home. I knew you. You've come a long way, Some 47. Sleep. And even now, you don't remember. This place. This was our prison, where Father trained us, shaped us into killers for Providence. Uh, you don't remember. They ripped it out of you, wiped it away, but I do. I remember everything. You're a terrorist with nothing to lose. You'd say anything. I know oh, it's man. difficult. You never miss your mark or question your function, but we made a pact. You and I. Do this. We both lose. There was an incident. That boy, he died. He lived. Because of you. Don't you remember his name? You know this. Deep down, you know. What was his name? Steve. Subject 6. No, I was Your close. name is Subject 6. And what is our purpose? To take them all down. Okay. Right, so the next one is another life, it would appear. Um, but I'm going to have to stop there because, yeah, uh, that's, uh, yeah, that's the, uh, the thing. Um... But yeah, thanks for watching. I uh, really appreciate it because it's been nice to play this again, actually. Um, yeah, it's been really nice to play this again. Uh, and I think I'm pretty getting close to the end, actually. I mean, 
What's this? Is this the last level, actually, for this? Another life? I think it is, right? For this, um... It's the last level for... Let's, have a, let's go back and look for Hitman 2. Let's have a look. Uh, what have we got here? Destinations, campaign. So, right. So, if I go to Hitman 2... Uh, done chasing guys, another life. Oh, hang on, maybe no. There's no, there is more. There's more. There's the Ark Society. And there's also Golden Handshake. And then but hang on, are these like. Oh, no, no, these are ones. These are DLC. Okay. That's fine. Um, because, yeah, I've done Hitman 3 already. And I've done Hitman 1, so it's just, yeah, just those ones. Anyway, um, and we've got all some of these as well, maybe at some point, I don't know. Um, yeah, as I said, thanks for watching, and I'll be back next... No, I won't be ne next week, because next week we're going to be in Sunderland, um, because we've got TCGS Con North North uh, happening. It's funny how it's, like, crept up, like, really quickly, and, um, yeah, it's happening, happening next week. So, uh, but, yeah, after that... Oh, I guess I'll be back. Uh, see you later. And, um, yeah. Hope to see you at TCGSCon. North North. Bye-bye.